heavy defeat last week. What have the conversations been related to the Raiders this week for you guys? Uh, yeah, it was a you know, uh, heartbreaking loss for us to go up there and uh, not get the two points. Uh, the big focus from the weekend was just making sure, you know, we did some really good things on the weekend, making sure we do that again and uh, just continue to improve. We've only got a few weeks left of the season, so we need to make sure we, we start firing. A couple of key inclusions this week, Jerome Hughes among them. He was on fire the last time he was out. What are you wanting to see from him this week? Just a bit of the same, that's his job. He's a, he's a fantastic player and he brings a lot to the team. So, uh, yeah, it'll be good to have him on the weekend. He, he controls the team really well, a lot of good talk. And, um, yeah, so we'll be expecting a little bit about that when he uh, gets back out of there on the weekend. And Xavier Coates as well, what are we expecting from him this weekend? It's the same again. It's the usual, you know what Xavier's going to bring to the game for us. Um, he's an experienced player, um, offers a lot to the team. So this weekend, he's, he's probably, he was itching to get in last weekend. So no, it would be good to go this weekend, hopefully. And you've started the last two weeks now, is that right? Or are you off the bench? Or? No, last two weeks, yeah. We started in the back row, yeah. So how is it kind of being able to do that again? You've had a bit of inconsistency, I suppose, throughout your season. So how good is it being able to be on the park from the get-go now? Oh, it's nice. It's a bit different, you know. Starting a game, it's a bit more intense in the first few uh, few minutes. But um, you know, I'm just grateful to get the opportunity when it when it comes my way to start the games, and I just try and do my best for the team. Raiders this weekend, uh, it's, it shapes a really good clash, I suppose. You're both in the mix for finals to, to do some damage come finals. But I suppose is it exciting to be able to come up with such a, a strong position so close to finals to test where you're at? It is. You what you really want to. Test, test yourself like we did last week and um, you know figure out what you need to improve before the finals so it's exciting you know this Sunday that we'll uh, get the opportunity to come against them I think last few times they've come down here they've probably uh, surprised us a little bit so we'll make sure we're you know ready to go Sunday. Yeah I think they've won their last five down here so you're it's... obviously wanting to buck that trend this weekend. Yeah, it'd be nice to. I think we all enjoy playing at Amy, so it's just, you know, the fans make an effort to come out, and I think it's, you know, we like winning down here, so that's what we're trying to do. Nice to be home. It's good to be home, always good to be home. And Ryan, the plan for him, does he need a bit more game time before he will play? Yeah, so he played half a game on the weekend, so he'll play a little bit more, I think, and just, you know, take it how it comes with him. If he's pulling up all right, they'll just keep giving him a little bit more, so. Yeah, he went all right on the weekend too, which was good to see. Have you spoken to him during the week? He must just be so happy to be back out of the park. Yeah, yeah, he's just he's just happy to be playing footy again, you know. Um, obviously, still a bit to do before he gets back, but you know, just it's you know a week of training and being able to play footy, you know, he's enjoying it. Did you catch any of the women's World Cup action while you're locked out? <laughs> Um, we've, we've been keeping an eye on it, yeah, no, it's been uh, good to see the Matildas going well and getting a few good wins. 